Okay. Okay, they all just got nursed. And now they're all content. And again, three weeks old today. Mommy cleans them so well. Mommy's a good mommy. Mommy, awesome mommy. They're starting to interact a little bit today. I've noticed that they're biting on each other's faces a little bit. Oh yeah, you need to help up here. Show the world your face. And of course when they have that nice full belly of milk, they're a little bit more lethargic. But get over here. Get over here. You wake up and show the world what a pretty little girl you are. See, we just tired. We don't want any of this movie stuff. We just got the little boys right here. I just love this little boy right here. He is just beautiful. He's so pretty. And I'm so glad that he's going to a breeder because I deserve it. Yes, if he has a good bite, everything turns out well. Sometimes I think they know what I'm saying. They just look at me so intently. They're definitely doing awesome. I'm just very proud of these little puppers here. I'll do an, another video of them in probably in two more weeks and you're going to see a huge, huge difference because from the video, the first one you saw when they were just about three or four days old to now this one, which they're three weeks old, now they're going to really be changing massively. Um, as far as personality goes and of course growth but they're still going to start getting real active they're going to start playing with each other going to play with mommy and just they're just going to get so sweet and then when we get to be about say six or seven weeks old we have the real sumo wrestling happening because they will fight and play and scream and bite and squeal and you know you let them do that and of course, we don't let it get too far out of hand, but they have to do that. That's socializing. They have to learn that when they bite something, like their brother or sister, and that brother or sister yelps, that's telling them to stop. So it's important, and I just cannot stress enough how important it is to keep puppies until they are at least 10 to 12 weeks old. This is so important to their socializing they socialize you know not only within their pack of puppies but they also socialize with with people and, and it makes such a better puppy a, a much better dog a more relaxed happy you know very contented animal and you know I'm, I'm sorry I'm not an advocate for people having puppies and getting rid of them at six weeks. That's that's totally not my thing. It is, it, some people just, I, I guess they just don't want to deal with them because it is a lot to handle. They're going to get real rambunctious and, you know, having a puppy is like um, having a child. You have to keep your house so clean because I promise you, if it's on the floor, they're going to find it. You got to wrap up your wires and you got to make sure that they can't get in any kind of danger. You know, and yes, it is work, but that's all part of breeding, you know, and you're taking on a huge responsibility bringing in, bringing in little animals in the world. And I also can't express enough that animals are a huge responsibility. You know, it's these little guys will live to be 15, 16 years old. And, you know, that's a long time, and that's a lot of responsibility, so I always, you know, monitor and filter my fires just to make sure that they are going to do what's right by my puppies, and I hope that I do right by them as well. Thank you.